Hey guys, welcome back. So we just came from the grocery store and I have my little one in the background. He's eating a banana. So you might hear him because he's kind of grunting, being silly. Anyway, so this is our two week meal plan and then some extras. So this time I decided to split it up. So probably about right here is like the main dishes for the next two weeks and then over here is just kind of some snacks and some things where we're getting low on some extra stuff whatnot so I thought I'd split it up I mean you know you probably don't really care but I thought maybe it'd make it easier to explain so let's get going and of course this is an HEB haul all right so way in the back here I got a bag of potatoes some milk veggie juice and let's see if I can pick these up and see them. They're the peeled tomatoes, the petite diced tomatoes, tomato sauce, and two cream of chicken and two cream of mushroom. Then we have some lasagna noodles and back here is just some regular um, rotini noodles. Um, then we have brown rice, some organic strawberry preserve, the ingredients on here were pretty simple, and I usually like to puree, puree his um, any like fruit, but I thought I'd pick this up because it was pretty. There was only just a couple main ingredients, which were fruit, and I thought, well, I can use that for a backup to put like on his toast if we're kind of having a busy morning and I don't have any fruit, you know, mixed up for him. So anyway, I thought I'd give that a go. Some stew meat some ground chuck and then there's just a big thing of chicken on the bottom there some blueberries a bag of apples I have not tried apples with him yet so I thought I would cut up some strips of apples maybe put some cinnamon and maybe put them in the oven to get them real soft some strawberries too because I'm making a flag cake for the 4th of July so I definitely knew I was going to use a lot of strawberries. So of course I went ahead and picked up another one because I love me some strawberries. Some jello for my cake. Some bananas. And the cheese is crazy. I got two shredded um, cheddar cheese, some mozzarella, and some parmesan. I got some sticks of carrots head of broccoli and a sweet potato and that's actually for Lucas for my little one some ricotta cheese peaches these look really good so I hope they're good and I think that's pretty much the main stuff and over here is just some extra so I got some tin foil some Yoplait whips Greek yogurt I had a coupon to get one of these for free so I thought I'd try it out some Kashi bars some um, organic like granola bars these were really good just some chocolate in case I need some I know this is bad for you but I don't care because sometimes I just need my chocolate you know what I'm saying some eggs by the way eggs were almost three dollars I have not seen them that much and I knew we were gonna be seeing them pretty high soon so FYI yeah you know if you um you have to let me know if you're seeing um, eggs a lot higher these days because I know they had to get rid of some chickens blah 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 so some bread some brownie brittle I ate this in like two days some wheat thin chips and we were running low on ranch and honey mustard same with some Aunt Jemima syrup another little chocolate snack for me Oreo minis strawberry pop tart some free pancakes. I've talked about it before. We got a whole year's supply of free pancakes. I thought I'd try this out. It's the HEB brand gluten-free cookie, chocolate chip cookie mix. Looked interesting. Oh, way back here is an onion. And lastly is this uh, Pillsbury Simply, uh, Purely Simple White Cake. And I'm going to use this for the flag cake. And I had a coupon for it, so I thought I'd try it out. I haven't tried this purely simple yet 
But anyway, that is it. Like I said, I tried to just separate it a little bit. So, and don't forget to stay tuned and I'll show you what we have planned for the next two weeks. These next two weeks are a little up and down strange. So I'm only making about four meals. So it's a little less this time. But anyway, just stay tuned for that and I'll show you what we're going to be making. Hey guys, welcome to my two week meal plan. So let me open up my book and show you what we're going to have. And like I said in my HEB haul, grocery haul, these next two weeks are kind of off. So the meals are just kind of plain Jane simple. So there's only going to be about two meals per week and then we have the holiday. So anyway, that's why you might notice this next two weeks is a little off. but. This will start June 29th through July 5th. So I went to the grocery store on Tuesday. That's why I have a GS grocery store. And I'm going to do a chicken parmesan casserole. And then later on in the week, I'm going to do a chicken broccoli rice casserole. And then we have the 4th of July. That's coming up on this weekend. And I'm going to do some hot dogs with baked beans. And then I'm making a flag cake. And I might do something else. It's just gonna be us three nothing fancy just something simple for us to do but I'm still gonna go to the store probably gonna go to Target and I might pick up a little something else we'll see I'm not sure yet and of course I have my market list all on the side over here and then the following week July 6th through the 12th I'm gonna do a vegetable stew a lasagna soup and I believe that's it, because like I said, these next two weeks are a little off. And once again, my market list is over here. All this stuff, I still need to check this. I know I have this, but I'm just going to double check, make sure I have it. But we should be good to go. And as you can see, it's pretty simple for the next two weeks. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.